So you book that big shoot and damn, you get there and realize you forgot your most faithful, useful piece of equipment. Oh no, what are we gonna do? What's up guys, how you doing? Welcome back to Espresso, Full Mug Media's value pack show where we try to give you as much value in as little time as possible. And today, we're gonna be talking about the three must-haves for a shoot. And as always, everything and anything I talk about will be listed and linked in the description section below with affiliate links and links off and the, even the link to the article version of this so you can get some more value out of that as well. In my experience, if something can go wrong, it will go wrong. So that being said, my first must-have for a shoot is two sources of audio. I like to bring a shotgun mic with me and I also like to bring a lavalier mic. I'm using the lavalier mic right now, as you can hear. I use all Rode audio, so I don't really have any issues there. Um, but at the end of the day, two sources of audio is a must have because if you get there and maybe maybe even in something simple like your double A's and your receiver dies, but your, your nine volt in your shotgun battery is fine. So even in something very minuscule like that where you just don't have time to run across the street to Walgreens or whatever, it, it, it's a lifesaver in scenarios. So if you've got the little bit of extra space that it takes to bring an extra mic, or an extra set of labs or something, throw them in your bag. I promise you won't regret it. You might get annoyed on two or three shoots and be like, oh, Kane, I brought this extra source of audio and I never needed it. But you will one day and then you'll be like, oh my gosh, Kane, you saved my life, thank you. And I'll be like, you know what, you're welcome. No big deal. Now, I'm gonna bring up another one that I'm gonna say a lot of people will have in their bags at all times, but for the one person watching this video that doesn't, gaffer's tape, gaffer's tape, gaffer's tape, Gaffer's tape, bring gaffer's tape to every shoot you're ever on ever. I don't care if you have to tape the roll to your back. Like it is, oh, oh my, oh my God. Especially if nobody else brought gaffer's tape, you will be a godsend on that set. You need gaffer's tape on any set. It's, it's super not, you can do anything with it. Gaffer's tape is the most invaluable piece of equipment I have. It's not one of my cameras or this tripod. I really like this tripod, but yeah, it's, it's super, super, super useful. I use it all the time for every Thing from blocking out logos to making sure a light stays put to making sure a cord isn't tripped over and following suit with the same mindset from earlier with the whole you know redundancy thing bring extra SD cards that's my last must have for a shoot extra SD cards because you will run out of storage the same way you will run out of battery and you will wish you had brought another one even though you were like I'm never gonna go through all this what if you didn't actually hit delete on the trash can like if you didn't empty the trash can on your MacBook after you've deleted files and you put that in your camera and you think you're ready to go and you get there and you realize oh I have an entire SD card full of stuff and I don't have time to sit here and manually delete it you will be upset with yourself but it'll be easier if you can just pop that open and put in another SD card um, and then make like a note in your phone that you switch to that SD card because it's gonna be, it's just so much easier than not having it. And, and so many people don't. So many people don't bring extra storage space. I don't know why I'm always the only person or one of the only people with extra space. Like it's just mind boggling. Yeah, extra SD cards, gaffer's tape, and two sources of audio are definitely all three of my most important things to bring on a shoot. They're across the board the most important too. So it's like, this is something that no matter the shoot, it doesn't matter if it's a music video, a commercial, uh, a business commercial, I'm flying the drone, it, it doesn't matter. I always always bring two sources of audio, two sources of backup store, like two storage sort solutions, I guess, um, and gaffer's tape. Always, 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 and I never regret any of it. So please let me know what your three must-haves for a shoot are because I'm actually really curious what you guys have to have with you all the time. I'm particularly curious for a couple of my friends' responses. I think you guys know who you are. Let me know what do you bring with you on every shoot. Not just like, oh, I'm shooting a real estate video so I definitely have to have my gimbal, like we know. What do you bring to every shoot? Let me know in the comment section down below or hit me up on Twitter or make a response video. Um, that'll be it. All right, hope you guys liked the video. If you did, drop it a like. If you didn't, drop it a favorite. As always, I appreciate your, your, your you know, you giving me your time. It's uh, your time. You don't have, you don't have a lot of it. So the fact that you spend it here, the fact that you spend it reading the articles, that you spend it commenting and sharing it with every person who's ever, you know, lived, it's really means a lot to me. 